I think trends is um, definitely in terms of platforms where people are going. So, I, and now it's very cliched, but I think uh, it, TikTok is de- definitely where our audience lies. People are buying more online. They are getting more influenced by uh, you know people like them, not necessarily influencers. Now they, I think people are also more educated in terms of the fact that they know if a certain influencer is uh, covering a product, they know it's paid for. They know that there's incentive there. People are already aware of it now. Initially, that wasn't the case. Now people are aware that hey, if this influencer is uh, doing you know something on this product. This product is uh, sponsored. Customers are very smart nowadays. They know very smart nowadays. It's branded content. They get to know about that. Absolutely, and the the whole new generation, the Gen Z, or so to call, they love uh, the fact that you as a brand are like them. That you, you know, the word that you use, humanize the brand. You fail in front of them. You succeed in front of them. You make them a part of the journey as well. You take their feedback and you shout out to the world that hey, thank you for telling us this feedback. I did not know this. You have to talk to them like you are a person. So I think humanizing your brand is very very important. You can't be like, oh, I'm standing on a pedestal as an authority and I tell you what to do. You you can't be that anymore. You have to be part of the crowd. So and TikTok like lets you be a part part of the crowd, right? Because if you is a see on TikTok, of course it's content that you post, but then you are having these conversations on the comments as well, and then people ask you questions, you reply to them. They'll say bad things, then you reply to them as well. Like you don't have to always only highlight the goods about you. You have to. show people how you're handling the bad feedback as well i think just that fact has helped us as well um, connect a lot more with our customers you know we've had angry customers who we converted into advocates just because of the way we were able to handle that situation customer right? service is very important as well very very important the way you talk to people is very you have to make them feel important that like that they're heard just because they're spending you know 30 dollars against like 100 dollars that somebody else is spending on your shop doesn't make their voice lesser so i think in terms of trend you have to humanize yourself as a brand you have to try and get on these platforms and don't i think these post poster sort of posts is not working anymore get out of that comfort zone it's easy to make posters on canva but get out of that comfort zone get in front of the camera start showing your face to people start talking to people if you are not comfortable showing your face then get somebody else as a spokesperson to show your face to people but be a brand and i'm not talking just about cpg brands right i'm talking about boring brand brands as well like insurance i'm talking about like everybody you need to talk to your audience where they feel like they're talking to a person and not to a blackboard you know So I think yeah humanizing your brand getting on these platforms for what that platform is meant for like on TikTok you can't just post a slide show right mm-hmm. that platform is meant for you to interact with your audience to show your face to your audience be on that platform and be true to what that platform stands for so be on the platform because that platform talks to a certain audience in the way and yeah i think third is uh, what i said the whole be agile in terms of your models as well you can't just be a pure d to c you can't just be a pure retail you have to be somewhere in the middle so you have to be very very agile in that sense so quickly learn from where the world is moving because it's definitely moving faster than you ever can quickly learn and adapt to how the world is moving and be in a place where the audience is where your customer is try and be the first person there so i think these three things in terms of trends uh, is where i see yeah people moving and brands moving as well